All right, what is up? This is Slow Plays back in some more Dragon Balls Universe 2. So today, guys, we are returning with the future Saiyan Saga pack. If you guys remember from a couple of days ago, I kicked off this entire mod showcase pack with Goku and Vegeta. And basically, these are just redesigns that are based off of art and created by my boy Little Wolf. He actually made the models. He did a great job. Again, go check them out in the description below, as always. I can't remember exactly who the artist was that actually, you know, this is based on, but he also did a really cool job to pretty much, uh, I guess, inspire my boy Little Wolf to create these, and they look awesome. They're, like, really intricate. It kind of reminds me of, like, a live-action series for, like, I guess, Dragon Ball or something like that. Not Dragon Ball Evolution, even though a lot of people did point out that this was very similar. The gi that Goku wears was very similar, and I can't unsee it now, you know what I mean? But uh, still, regardless of anything, it looks awesome. I am extremely stoked to be trying out the other five characters. I'm going to call this one, I guess, the Future Saiyan Saga Z pack or whatever, or if you want to call it the Z team or the Z squad pack, because we're going off of uh, basically everyone from the Saiyan Saga that weren't, you know, Goku, I guess. Mainly that. <laughs> so, you know, Vegeta and Nappa were the enemies, and we do have two other characters, you know, the villains that we're going to show off in a separate video. But if this video does really well and you guys seem to enjoy it as much as the original first version of it where we had Goku and just Vegeta, then I'll be sure to provide you guys with the last two characters. But other than that, we're going to go ahead and check out my boy Gohan. Look at this cute little kid, dude. What's up, man? What is good? So we got Future Saiyan Saga Gohan. He's got, you know, the bandana on or I guess the headband, not the bandana. I don't know what I'm saying. Thinking about Bardock for a second there. But uh, we have, like, this nice purple color going on. So basically, it's just Gohan reinvented with that same style of gi that his dad has. And I guess everyone from the future Saiyan Saga has if they're, you know, an actual, like, turtle hermit fighter or whatever. But this is supposed to be based off of, I guess, mainly, like, more of, like, Piccolo style. And, you know, he's got the little, you know, like, shoes, like, the little Shaolin shoes or whatever. Looking great. The hair's on point. It's basically just, you know, your normal kid Gohan with the new redesigned demon clothes. Now, moving on to Krillin. Same exact clothing as Goku, except... This time around, he's got, again, like the Shaolin Monk kind of uh, slip-on shoes. I don't even know. What are the actual, like, what's the actual term or name for this style of shoe? I always just call them slip-ons. But, yeah, looks great. So, Krillin looking amazing. Moving on here, we got Piccolo, which I love about his pants. I don't know what that is, that pattern. It's like a freaking skeleton or some skull design. I don't know, man. It's... It's got to be some Namekian stuff. I don't know what's going on at this point. But it looks cool. He has no cape on. He has no shirt on. He's just full on like naked at the top up. And then, you know, he's got the really sick uh, purple pants. And again, the slip-ons. Then we got Tien, which I really, really like Tien's style going on. Look at this. He's got like guards over his boots or something. It, it's so sick. And then look at his freaking... You see this? What is on his arm? Like, what are on his wrists and his arms? Like, these giant freaking barrels, bro. I don't know what's going on. I guess he's trying to avoid getting his arm cut off like he did last time <laughs> or something. Like, this is an alternate universe. But I absolutely think out of all of them, Tien has to be my favorite in terms of the design. And then, of course, we got the homie Yamcha wearing the exact same clothing that your boy Krillin's got. I think, uh, actually, are his wristbands? Yeah, the, the like, wrappings around his wrists and his arms have a little bit more wrapping on it. He's got some, like, white on there, so still really sick. Again, he has the little symbol down in the corner, just like with Krillin, and I don't know why I went to Tien. I was trying to go to Krillin. My boy, what's going on? Krillin is killing everyone. Yo, big shout-outs to the homie D-Free, because, you know, we're going to be Krillin it out here. You already know it. So I'm going to be checking out my boy Gohan first. Again, I walked through the moveset. I don't want to walk through it too you know, intricately or whatever, but we're going to showcase all the characters, just have fun with it, and it's just going to be an awesome, massive mod pack, so if you guys are excited for it, be sure to smash that like button, let's try to reach 15 likes on this video, that would be so amazing, and I would truly, really appreciate it, plus sure that you guys want to see more Dragon Balls Universe 2 content on this channel, as well as a continuation of the mod series, because the mod series is my favorite series, if I'm going to be honest, I love doing the mods, I know you guys like the mods too, now we can just collectively enjoy as a community the mods together. You already know it, my friends. It's very good for your neck. Oh, yes. Go on style. <laughs> all right. So no actual power-ups. All right. I know I know. a lot of people were like, we're the Super Saiyan that, but that's okay. We got a little bit of a surging spirit action going on. Gohan's got the freaking Kefla run, a.k.a. the Naruto run, a.k.a. Uzumaki, freaking Boruto's dad. What's up? All right. So 
Gohan is tiny. He is a small little guy. You already know it. But it's fun using his moveset. Uh, I can't remember if this is actually Gohan's moveset or not. I never used Kid Gohan. But the fact that he was doing that little, like, twist and twirl was hilarious. Look at that. Woo! Woo! Oh, the big kid. Actually, future... Not future, but, like, uh, I guess future Saiyan Saga. Uh, little mini Gohan here is fun. Look, I love that little, like, twist kick. I feel like they... They did a really good job with uh, some of the movesets in this game. Maybe, you know, in terms of the skill and everything, it's kind of annoying. Actually, yeah, I think this is actually Gohan. This should be, you know, Kid Gohan. I don't know what else it would be. I'm being an idiot or something like that, which you guys know. I'm, I'm a pretty much a dope. So you already know it. So we're going to try and get a 15-hit combo here because uh, 15 is one of my favorite numbers. You guys already know it. I mean, I like 11 and I like 15. Something about those two numbers are sick. We have the Energy Wave combo, real basic. Again, I didn't want to change too much in terms of the skill set here, but as you can see, Piccolo's health regenerates, as it always is. You know, very cool stuff. I like that about Piccolo. We have the Evil Ray Strike. Kind of reminds me of that time whenever, you know, he blew up the freaking, uh, what was it, a mountain? Whenever Piccolo threw him. Dude, shout out to the OG Dragon Ball Z series. I'm talking, like, beginning episodes. Like, you already know it, dude. Like, the very start, I'm talking, like, episode 1 to 30 or something. Those are, like, pretty OG, if I'm... I must say so myself. So I'm going to go and try out this Concentrated Masinko Ha, which is actually, uh, I think it's a custom move. It looks like Atomic Blast. That's what it kind of looks like. But, uh, you know, it's in the Masinko. Masinko! I can't remember what it was. If it was in, like, a, like a sub version of it or something in, in the anime. He says Kamehameha, but he uses the Masinko. I can't remember if somebody edited that or something. I saw it on Twitter. So probably someone did edit that. Anytime you're on Twitter, you got to watch out, dude. Ooh, he's going for the nuts, bro. My boy Gohan, he learning how to like really, really just manipulate his opponents, man. He's just like, you know what? I'm going to go from the nuts. This man ain't going to got got no kids anymore. I mean, I guess Piccolo can't have kids because he reproduces asexually, if I'm not mistaken. But whatever. Uh, I'm going to go and try out the Super Kamehameha. It just looks awesome on Kid Gohan. Again, he should not have this move at all, but I gave it to him anyways because guess what? It's mods and I can. <laughs> That's the best part about it. See, again, anybody that doesn't like mods, yo entirely your opinion and i respect it homie i respect it but come on you cannot sit there and tell me that it's not fun to give characters these crazy moves unrelenting barrage <laughs> come for you and then finish it off with a grab a nice little backflip throw you already know so there you have it future saiyan saga gohan now it's time for Kurillin. Man, not gonna lie. Not gonna lie. Krillin looks sick, all right? He looks sick in this gi. Krillin's a cool character. I don't care what anyone says. Every single Dragon Ball character looks sick. I mean, in terms of the Z fighters, Piccolo's dope. Vegeta's dope. Tien's sick. He's got a third eye and, like, this awesome clothing. And then Yamcha, I always love. I'm gonna be honest, okay? One thing about Yamcha that is always sick is his hairstyle because he's got, like, Gohan's hairstyle, too. Yamcha looks good. He looks like a Saiyan himself, and that's why I love him, man. So we're gonna try out this Orin combo here. I don't know why I'm doing it in the air. And actually, can I just pull this off? <laughs> Let's get it. All right. Destructo Disc Super Style. Goku Sensu Bean. Sensu. <laughs> Dude, shout out to my boy Sunny Straight. He knows what's up. Yeah, Sally Krilling ain't got no freaking... <laughs> he got no key or stamina. You know, poor little guy. For Power Energy Wave, seen it a million times. But, you know, might as well give it to him. I don't know what else I would give him. Maybe, like, Super Kamehameha. But I didn't want to give everybody Super Kamehameha. Try to, you know mix it up a little bit scatter kamehameha a really really sick move not sure why it's called kamehameha i wish it was blue if it was blue that would be a lot cooler dude but uh, other than that you know scatter kamehameha is the og the surging spirit spread shot retreat basically all we got going on here move set wise uh you know he's got the normal krillin move set still really fun to use and other than that i mean he's just a little shaolin monk shout out to shaolin showdown dude Shaolin Showdown. I was about to say Mortal Kombat and then go. Yo, shout out to Smosh, man. The OGs of that. You know, like, I guess lip sync crap. It's sad, man. Lip sync stuff. You know, it used to be so good. Now we got this TikTok garbage, man. I'm like, nah, bro. Get out of here with that. <laughs> so, there you have it. I mean, Krillin, again, there's not a lot of crazy stuff with him, but I thought I'd just show the rest of them off anyways because it's really fun. Let's go ahead and drop my boy Piccolo. Piccolo style. And I sound like All Might. <laughs> Piccolo does kind of sound like All Might. I mean, because it's the same voice actor. Shout out to Christopher Savage, man. It's my boy. But, yeah, we're going to go ahead and slap up uh, my boy Yamcha here just because he was kind of sitting there, you know, talking big, massive shit. And, you know, I have to show him what's up, man. We got to show him what's up. So, the best thing about Piccolo is his moveset. Uh, you know, stretchy arms. Like, come on, man. It's too good. We have that Sonic Kick, which is so fun to use, dude. Boom. Boom. 
<laughs> oh, oh. I actually don't even know how to use this move, but let's be real. I don't know how to use any of these moves. Light grenade, a nice little burst of energy. Kind of, uh, I guess, like stuns your opponent just for a quick second. You know, it's not too long, but it's got a little bit of a hit stun to it. We have the paralysis beam. Ooh, looks... Oh, okay, so that's... That's a from behind move, right? Yeah, there we go. That's what I like to see here. Does it actually paralyze? I actually don't know, but I'm just gonna break the stamina anyways. Go for that surging spirit. Shot this hell zone grenade. You ready? Dude, this is one of my favorite moves from Piccolo. One of the coolest things that came out of the uh, I guess Android Saga versus Android 17. Again, super underrated match that you guys gotta check out. Again, I recently watched it and it was just so sick seeing them just go at it. Animation was actually not too bad. But, uh, you know, it was just really sick scene. You know, Piccolo used this, and it was just awesome, man. Special Beam Cannon, a classic OG, the way he finished off the homie Raditz and, you know, Goku as well. But other than that, my friends, I mean, Piccolo is Piccolo. It's not too crazy or intricate. Again, just real fun and easy to showcase with the moveset. We got to go with that grab. You already know it. Boom, just throw him out of there. Get him out of there. All right, here, no, one more, one more. Super explosive wave. I love that move. It's like fire bursting out the seams, bro. All right, ready? Oh, and slam him down. So there you have it. Let's go and move on to my favorite design, TN. So my boy Yamcha is going to be taking all kinds of L's today, man. He just the guinea pig, man. He's just the guinea pig. So like I said, TN, bro, my favorite design out of all the characters. I love his moveset. He really goes for, like, traditional Asian-style kung fu, you know, taekwondo, jujitsu, mubutsu, kusutsu, and shaolutsu, all right? That's my favorite one. Shaolutsu is the best the best one, guys. You already know. <laughs> all right, let me try this out here on. Meteor Strike, is, you got to do it right. got to do it right. There we go. That's how you do it, my friends. All right, so tri-beam. I love tri-beam's design, bro. If somebody could, like, customize that and make it, like, a different color or something, that would be sick. Like, there's a lot of underrated moves in this game. We got solar flare. All right, let me get this up here. Neo tri-beam. Ah! 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 Whenever he was killing freaking, uh, what was it, Imperfect Cell? Another iconic part in the series. Loved it, man. Loved it. All right, let's try out this full power energy blast volley. I actually like this one a lot more than full power energy wave. It just looks cooler. But again, it's still really mediocre as a move. I'm gonna go for this. Ooh, 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 get those flurry punches. Man, Tien's moveset is actually really sick. Again, I don't really use these characters, like, ever. Actually, I think this might be the first time that I've ever used, you know, Tien in his, like, traditional moveset and actually as a character. Maybe I've seen this moveset from other characters before, but anytime we see, like, uh, I guess an Asian base character, Tien, Krillin, you know, maybe even a little bit of Yamcha going on there would work out. So, there you have it. Let's go ahead and chop my boy Yamcha to finish this off. Bro, bro, it's time. Who is my opponent? There he is. You already know what's about to go down, my friends. All right, let's get it. Oh, 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 ooh. Dude, see, look at this. Look at Yamcha's moveset. It's so dope, dude. Got the wolf fangs going on there. Got the kicks and the tricks and the Mickey Mouse. Yeah, let's go, dude. I don't know why I said Mickey Mouse, because I guess it kind of like rhymed or whatever. Shout out to my boy Rhyme Style. All right, here, hold up. Where'd he go? Where'd he go? This is a bad idea, because I'm doing too much damage. Spirit Ball. Let's get it. <laughs> that is a fun move. All right. Ready for this Neo Wolf Fang Fist? You already know it. Woo! <laughs> I love it, bro. I love it. All right, come on. Lock on the him again. Lock on the him again. Get back up. Yeah, yeah, that's right, mofo. You already know it. I'm not done with you yet. Kamehameha! Freaking dead there. What else do we have here? After image, dude. Yeah, that's, that's a real good move. Honestly, like, I don't even... I don't know why he has after image, but I guess he just has it. Again, I'm not really going to go crazy with that just because, you know, it's after image. There's nothing too great there. Super back jump is really cool because, you know, we have this massive freaking backflip. Like, I wish I could do that in real life. I don't even know how to do a normal backflip, but super Kamehameha just for the, you know, shits and giggles. You already know. How did I? Wait, what? Why is he over there? I locked on to him. Oh, whatever. It killed him anyway. So, there you have it, my friends. The full-on future Saiyan Saga Z-Pack. For the Z Fighters, beautiful showcase there. I love doing it. Now we got to go into the versus mode. And just have some fun. All right, my friends. So we're just gonna wreck people with Gohan. I'm gonna team up with Piccolo here, and you know what? We're gonna go against my boy Vegeta. We're probably gonna get destroyed, but it's only natural that we try this out and hopefully not completely get wrecked. Now, what stage do I want to go to? Tournament of Power. Don't ask why. Okay, it's a Tournament of Power. Again, it's mods. 
It's a showcase. We can do whatever we want. So the future Saiyan Saga, Z-Pack, going in hardcore with Gohan and Piccolo, mentor and student, or if you want to call it father and son. Again, people get upset about that, but hey, you know, in a way, he is a fatherly figure. That doesn't mean he's like his legitimate dad. I'm just saying, you know, he is a fatherly figure. And right now, my boy uh, Vegeta is going after the kid. He's going after the kid, the goat himself, my boy. Okay, why am I locked on to him? Wait, what just happened? I started locking on to someone else, and I did not want to. That's not that's not how it's got to be, my friends. All right, you ready, you ready, ready? All right. Vegeta, I swear to... Oh, my God. This freaking Cyberman is annoying, bro. All right, here we go. No, no, no. This is going to be a cluster. I already know it, dude. So, yeah, my main priority is actually trying to get Vegeta down here, man. Oh, come on, come on. Pow, 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 pow. No, 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 pow, pow. No crash, no mal. Oh, no. Come on, no, get him, go on. Wait, he knew exactly where I was going to go, dude. What the fudge? Drop dead. I'm scared, bro. I'm scared. Oh, crap. No, 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 big boy. There we go. That's what I like to see. All right, let's get this evil race strike. Oh! All right, I'm going to try this out. If I can pull it off, that would be phenomenal. All right, he's going to blast me out of here. All right, he's dead. Okay, perfect. Simon is gone. He's down for the count, but the problem is he does heal quickly. So we're going to have to you know, put in some work and damage here if I can actually help out my teammate. <laughs> So Piccolo's actually doing a pretty good job of, you know, helping out his, his boy, you know, his little boy right here. All right, ready for this? I want to finish this off with an unrelenting barrage if he'll let me. The problem is, the stage is so huge right now. All right, come on, dude, come on. No, 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 Gallic Gun. All right, let's get it. Charge it up. Oh, oh, look at that. That is so good, dude. I, I loved it. I loved how he didn't even, like, hit him at all. All right, the freaking Cyberman can just fuck off, man. All right, come on. Whoa! Let's get it. No, stop, stop, stop. Wait, what is going on, man? I don't understand. Did he just get healed or something? I feel like Vegeta's health has not decreased, like, at all. All right, perfect. Break it. Oh, that would have been great if I was able to pull it off. Come on. Oh, get him from behind. There we go. Break that stamina. Super Kamehameha wave. Perfect. We got him out of here, dude. Let's freaking go. I'll put the W in the book with that big one, two, three, four, boo. I don't know why I said that. I was actually riding a W in the air, but I just realized that you guys can't even see what I'm doing. So, shout out to me being a dunce as always. <laughs> what the fuck? I go, one, two, three, four, and I'm riding it in the air. I did it again, dude. Oh, my goodness. All right, my friends. So, that is going to do it for this pack. Thank you all so much for watching. Shout out to Little Wolf. Check him out in the description below. Leave a like on this video if you guys did enjoy it. And if you didn't, always feel free to give me constructive criticism or just any great feedback. I would appreciate it. Thank you guys so much. Peace out. Take care. Have a great day, my friends.